Oh my god, the world has gone webcam crazy, like seriously. People are selling their old crusty Logitech webcam for over $200. I'm not even joking. I think we know the reason why, because of the Toyota Corolla and everybody working at home. I'll probably get sued by Toyota for saying that, but I'm not saying that other C word. But yes, everybody's working from home and you can't buy a webcam anywhere. I've got you covered because you don't need a webcam. If you've got a camera that has HDMI out so it can display a picture over HDMI, you don't need a webcam and you're going to get much better results than what you do with the webcam. I mean Studio Pro quality. If you have a decent camera, of course, it will depend on what type of camera you got. But with this Elgato CamLink simple device, you can turn your camera into a professional studio quality webcam and it couldn't be easier. So in this video, you're going to find out how you turn your normal camera that has HDMI out. That's the prerequisite. It has to display from HDMI out on the camera and we're going to turn it into a webcam. And there's something really special about this. If you've got a pro camera, this thing, on a Mac at least, can capture your HDMI from your camera, ProRes, even in log footage. Yes, ProRes captures straight out of your camera up to 4K30. So anyway, what you get in the box here is just basically a USB dongle and a USB extension cable. That's it. And what this device does is essentially turns any camera with a HDMI out into a webcam. So once you plug this dongle into your computer and you connect your camera to this dongle into this device and into your computer, your computer will now see it as a webcam. It doesn't get any simpler than that. So you've seen those guys on the news shows and even just your normal TV shows where they're crossing to them because everybody's self-isolating and the quality looks horrendous on most of these feeds, like these video feeds from all these people. This is going to next level your video call or conference. And of course, you can use it for streaming. This is what all the pros use, the streamers. And everybody's looking at the streamers now and they're saying, how do they get such professional look when my webcam and I'm on national TV looks absolutely horrendous? Yes, those pro streamers use this, the cam link from our gato. So have a look at this. This is from a webcam, a high quality webcam, I'll say too. It's a Logitech C922, so it's a 1080p webcam, and it's not their cheapest one. It was one of their higher end ones. Not the absolute top of the line, but better than 90% of all webcams. And look at it. It looks all right. There's no dynamic range. There's no depth of field. It just looks like a webcam. And look at this. Woof. Yes, this looks like studio quality. Look at the depth of field. Look at the dynamic range. It looks amazing. So basically, it just takes the HDMI feed out of your camera, puts it into your computer as a webcam. So you can use it with Skype, Zoom, whatever, streaming. And as I said, you can capture your camera's footage 422 ProRes. Wow, uncompressed. Now just have a look here. This is a Panasonic SH1. This does 6K. And it will even take that 6K footage and then frame it in 4K. I wasn't expecting that. I was only expecting it to be able to take the 4K out of this camera. And of course, you can see all the display settings on the camera. You just turn that off. If you have a camera, you have to go inside and turn off the display. So you're only seeing the video feed. So it looks amazing, doesn't it? And it couldn't get any simpler than that. You just turn your camera on, it thinks it's a webcam. Just operate it like a normal webcam on your desktop, laptop, whatever, Windows or Mac. And yeah, just use it on Zoom, Skype, use it for streaming, OBS, all your streaming software. This is what you need and this is what the pro streamers use. So I'll leave a link in the description where you can get this. It's going to be cheaper than a webcam and you're going to get a much better quality video. So you know what it does and how easy it is to use. Now for you pros, have a look at this. This is in Premiere and we are looking at footage straight out of my camera captured on the Mac with QuickTime and I captured this at 4K30 uncompressed 442 ProRes. What? This is not its intended use, but the fact that it can do that makes this a professional device because you can tether your camera to this. 
to your laptop and feed your footage, raw ProRes, straight into your laptop. I mean, how cool is that? If you want a video of me showing you how I've done that, just let me know down there in the comments because it's something that really, if you look at like capture devices to actually capture raw video from your like professional camera, they're really expensive. So something so inexpensive like this, it's got a lot of versatility to it. It's going to help you with the webcam shortage. I mean, get one. Woof. If you really want to look pro, this is the way to go. So catch you in the next one. Tally ho.